Hello, good day. This is Andrew again, and now I'm going to teach you how to use diode for protection. First, let's define what is diode. Diode is an electronic device that only allows the flow of current in one direction. First application of the diode for protection is the reverse polarity protection. When we're dealing with DC power, polarity is very important. A reverse polarity might cause damage to the other electronic component. Here in this circuit, we install the diode here to protect the load. For forward bias, the current is allowed to flow. But for reverse bias, if the battery is accidentally placed in reverse, the current is not allowed to flow. For this circuit, as you can see, the installation of a battery here or a source might not be in reverse because it might affect the capacitor and that may cause damage to voltage regulator also. And because of that, we can install diode here to protect our circuit. Another protection that diode can provide is stored energy protection. Here, the diode is used to protect the transistor. It is used to discharge the stored energy. Before we continue discussing the diode protection, I want to discuss something about the inductor. What is an inductor? An inductor is an electrical device consisting of coil. Inductor temporarily stores energy in the form of magnetic field. This is how inductor works. By applying current to your inductor, it will generate a magnetic field Magnetic field remain for a short period of time, and that's the stored energy. That stored energy will be released and became a current again, and it will flow. Let's go back to the circuit. If I apply a current at the base of the transistor, it will allow the current to flow at the emitter and the magnetic field will be generated at the inductor. When I remove the current at the base, the current at the collector will be removed also. The stored energy will remain and the stored energy will try to enter the collector. And because there's the current at the base of the transistor and there is a current remaining at the collector, as time passes by, the stored energy will cause damage to the transistor. By putting a diode here, when you apply a current at the base, it will allow the current of the collector to flow. Magnetic field will be generated, and a diode at reverse bias is an open connection. It means that the current will not flow at the diode. Then, when I remove the current at the base, the current at the collector will be removed also. The stored energy will remain, and the diode at forward bias is closed connection. The stored energy will enter the diode instead of entering it to the collector. Let's try to make a demo between these two circuits. I want you to watch this one carefully.
and that's it thank you for watching this video and please like my facebook page and please subscribe to my youtube channel